From 9pm Friday to 5am Monday, this bridge will be deserted. A full closure is required to apply a new waterproof membrane to the concrete, then lay new asphalt. Uh, if we could have closed part of it, we would have absolutely done that, but it's not possible. We, we need to get this work done in a weekend and we've got to unfortunately close the whole bridge. Council investigations found concrete deterioration caused by water ingress, particularly in the south beams and slabs. Traffic diversions will be in place to direct motorists towards either the Captain Cook Bridge or Clem 7. All tolls will be waived for the duration of the closure. There will be a change to, to the route, so that will obviously create some issues, potentially some congestion in parts, but just make sure you leave yourself that extra bit of time to get around. Businesses and residents close to the bridge may experience some construction impacts, including vibrations, noise and dust. Although close to 200,000 motorists will be affected by this weekend's maintenance, cyclists and pedestrians will still have full access. Elkie Bowman, QUT News.